Another pollution watch today, but we've got two more cool fronts on the way. That next frontal boundary arriving later on tonight, and we will see some improvements in our ozone pollution situation. But for today, we've got five counties under that pollution watch. Meanwhile, along with the higher levels of uh, pollution. We are going to be dealing with extreme levels of ragweed pollen, grass pollen on the high end today. Elm tree has gone down a little bit, moderate levels along with the mold spores. Taking a look at the afternoon temperatures, similar to yesterday, that drier air blowing in is going to warm up very quick quickly. We'll see about a 30 degree temperature spread from where we started off this morning to where temperature readings will finish this afternoon. Close to 90 today out toward LaGrange and then overnight tonight under a mostly clear sky and that northeasterly breeze drier, cooler air moving in. So we'll have another refreshing start to the morning. Temperatures tomorrow morning in the mid to upper 50s to low 60s. So the progression of this front should arrive somewhere along the coastline later on tonight so that drier air, that cooler air will lag behind and uh, anticipating some beautiful weather to close out the week. Meanwhile, this is where all the moisture is. Very disorganized showers and thunderstorms in that area of the Caribbean. There is going to be the potential for development as we head into the weekend. Now we've got two tropical waves here. There's one the farthest away that has a low probability of formation. We're talking 20% during the next five days, but the area to watch for uh, most likely to develop this weekend is this area just to the south of Cuba, right off the coast here of Central America. We're looking at a 70% chance for tropical de uh, development, possibly a tropical depression or even our next name storm, which would be Gamma. Around here, no direct threats to Texas as we enjoy these next couple of fronts. By next week, if this moisture makes its way into the Gulf of Mexico, we may be seeing some increasing clouds Wednesday, Thursday, maybe even a few rain showers to pop up next Friday and Saturday.